guys, here we have the shoulder press machine. So you've got two adjustment points, one down here and one at the back. To be honest, if I was using this, I wouldn't adjust this very often, but it will adjust the seat forward and back. But for a shoulder press machine, that final position, the furthest back, is actually still working your shoulders, so I would leave it there, and often it will enable you to lift more weight and safer because you can get your shoulders tucked back and round. So, the seat adjustment you want to set so that your shoulder is really in line with the grips. Then it's on a cable stack, so you've got from 5 to 70, and whenever I start these, I'd always start a little bit lighter, make sure that um, you're familiar with the movement and you're comfortable with the movement and you can do it effectively and safe. And then you want that chest up, bum and back to the seat, breathe and brace, and then you're just gonna press up till your arms come straight at the top. And what you don't wanna do is bang the weights to the bottom, so this, the weight should always not touch the bottom, and that means that the muscle stays loaded. This is mainly working the front and the side of your shoulder. Uh, might get a little bit of assistance from your triceps, uh, but the it, it, majority is gonna be work from, for your shoulders, so if you want bigger shoulders, uh, you know, you're in the right place. And yeah, I hope you enjoy it and get stuck in.